it's going okay. Um, I'm having a few problems getting the message across and I need to, I think I've been giving too many instructions and being too impersonal. So I'm looking at using more hands-on techniques. Well, I was pretty clear that there was a positional play problem. Um, I think I just leapt in too quickly though and didn't allow the players to have a say and I didn't listen to what they had to say. The next step is to consult with a mentor. Okay. This helps okay. ensure you're on the right track. Your mentor views your tape and discusses it with you. Their role is to serve as a sounding board for your oh, self-evaluation. Hold, hold, hold it, hold it. What's happening you guys? You're both in the same spot. What's going on? So you'd like to work on your questioning? Yeah, I think I need to ask um, less rhetorical questions and uh, be a bit more focused in what I'm asking. So what would be a better way of asking the question then? Um, probably if I direct the question at the individual and just get a little bit more specific in what I'm actually asking them to do. Good. Yeah. Well, having a mentor really helped me clarify what I needed to do to improve. Having a mentor was fantastic. It um, was great to have someone there, not only to provide feedback on um, the technical aspects of coaching, but also on how effective I was being in the instructions I was giving and the communication I was using and the rapport that I had with the athletes and uh, also to confirm that um, I was on the right track. You should now be ready to design some practical plans for improving your coaching and then be in a position to implement them. Well, I'm going to ask more focused questions and just listen more attentively. I'm going to use some parallel talking, I think, where I can actually physically manoeuvre Lisa into the position while explaining to her where her body should be. I think that will be the best approach. Now to the Hi. last step. After practising for a few sessions, you need to make another recording of your coaching and see how you've gone. Were the changes okay, effective? What more needs to be done? Um, when you're driving into the middle here, were you aware of where Kylie was? Yeah, I saw her, but I thought she was going to change direction. So yeah. Well, how do you think you can avoid that? Because you're coming in on top of her. I thought maybe you hadn't seen her, but you had. You did see her. Yeah. So what, what do you think you can do? We'll, we'll stop at the transverse and have a look for a little bit longer, and maybe we'll see where Tanya's yeah. going as well. That sounds good. OK, I think it's a matter of stopping, having a look, before you drive into that space. All right? Probably to you well, as well. the it's questioning that I'm now using is seems to be a better way of approaching tactical problems, right, especially right. with senior players, and they seem to respond to it quite well. So I think just having a look That's at my it. own coaching Not through video self-analysis has really helped me yeah, in well a done. practical Great way. Play, guys. Good stuff. Now, this is the position you guys are in, OK? See, we're nice and we're bent here at the hips, OK? Well, when we run, we want to be in a nice extended tall position there. Okay, so if I just demonstrate on you, Lisa, one hand on my shoulder here. Now lift this knee up, okay. Now push up onto that back toe there, push up. Now that's where you should be when you're doing these drills, okay. And we've just got to keep this toe here up as well. Right, so we keep up nice and tall, okay. So we're getting our knee up to parallel, our shoulders are up and chest is, is forward, all right. And it's a nice tall position, we haven't got any angle here. See that, Sharon? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's see how we go. Let's try and get into that nice tall Lisa's position. improving, which is great so that means it has been successful. Um, the use of the video to observe myself and my communication methods has, has been great. Um, there's still a lot of things that I can do better but uh, I'll be definitely using this process again. Yes well done that was much better girls. Now it's your turn. You know how the process works. Give it a try and see how it can benefit your coaching. Video self-analysis is a very useful way of ensuring that you continue to improve as a coach.